sing in Spanish like I know she's speaking fluently Shining like a diamond so I call her Mrs. Jewelry You might lose your fame but baby you ain't never losing me You and me together All right, hey guys, today's a beautiful day outside. I'm gonna take you guys along on my journey. Um, well, from out to do my errands. It's like three o'clock yesterday, well today, because you guys will see this today once I get home, but it's like around 3.30 right now. I stayed up to 6.30 in the morning. I didn't wake up till like two o'clock. So I'm just getting out the house. I need to go to the bank, to Walmart, to the dollar store, to Five Below. I need to go to like four stores. So I'm going to take you guys on the journey with me. It's super hot out here. It's like 80 degrees out here. First need to go to the bank. Probably won't show you guys that. But after the bank, we'll get to Walmart. I feel the wind blowing past me. i got to show you guys my new book bag. I really love this book bag that I have on right now. I'll show you guys later. I'm super hungry though. And I can feel the wind going past my hand, which is bad. The wind kind of stopped, but the wind's still blowing. But basically, I just wanted to say, I'm going to talk louder. The wind's still... Basically, I wanted to say, make sure you check out my Bean Bozo Challenge and make sure you check out me trying Chipotle for the first time. And also, make sure you check out my water park vlog that I did. Three videos Bean Bozo Chipotle Water Park vlog. Make sure you check that out. Hopefully, you guys can hear me. I'm hoping I might see a Lamborghini today or an exotic. But I'm going to give you guys a time lapse. And three, two, hold on. Three, two, one. I saw a blue GTR and I saw a pink GTR. This wind, I can't film anything because the wind's blowing. But I did see a pink GTR and I saw a blue GTR. I couldn't capture it because it went by too fast. I'm still hoping to catch the Lambo. This wind is like really annoying. I can't film anything because you guys won't hear what I'm saying. It's like, it's making me mad. I used to work at TJ Maxx, which is kind of funny. One reason I think it's kind of funny because I know Pontiac made DDG also used to work at TJ Maxx. So that's a fun fact. And guys have been watching me for a long time know why I quit. <laughs> If you don't know why I quit, you probably have to go back to my old vlogs from September and October. Then you'll know why I quit. But I'm almost close to Walmart right now. I'm sweating so much, bro. I'm literally right across from Walmart. I'm literally sweating a lot. And I'm hungry, I'm thirsty. This one has really been getting on my nerves because it's messing up my audio. 
It's like I really can't do nothing about the wind noise when I go back to edit this. I really can't. Now I gotta try to get across the street. I'm sweating up a storm, but hopefully I can get in and out of Walmart quickly. I'm not trying to be in here too long. I do want to get back home early. She was stirring. Can I help you? That lady was stirring hard back there with that car. She was stirring hard. Got fireworks over there. That's a big tent. That's a super huge I'm like so hot. <sighs> Alright guys, let me get some bagels. Like for some reason I've really been craving bagels and cream cheese. So I'm looking for some bagels to buy. Can't find a bread. But I do want some strawberry cream cheese though. I guess we have a pan there bread, which I've only had one time. But I really want some bagels and cream cheese. Which I hope doesn't go bad before I get home. This little thing is three dollars. We got it. 
りがしたんだよね Strawberry cream cheese. This little thing is three dollars. They got some bagels right here. I want some raisin. They got when they got whole wheat. Where's the raisin bagels at? Blueberry. They got cinnamon swirl. I'll take this. I got what I needed. I'm going to treat myself. I did say I wanted some cheesecake. So let me get some cheesecake before I leave. Sometimes in life you have to treat yourself. Alright guys, I got the strawberry cheesecake, strawberry uh, cream cheese and the bagels from uh, Walmart. I don't know why, but I'm just having a strawberry craze right now. That's why I brought my backpack because instead of carrying the bags, I could just throw it in my backpack and throw it in my back. So it makes it easier when I do errands like this. That's why I bought the backpack, which I'll show you guys later. But now I'm on my way to the dollar store that I got to go to five below. But after the dollar store, I'll probably stop at McDonald's to get something to eat. I'm really craving a strawberry smoothie. I don't know what it is with strawberries today, but a strawberry banana smoothie, my bad. I'm like super hungry. I haven't eaten nothing all day so far. So go to the dollar store. Put this back in my backpack and keep the journey going. I don't know what time it is, but I'm trying to be back home by 6 or 6.30, you know? That way I can have this vlog uploaded within a decent time for you guys. But stay tuned. Sorry if the clip in there got messed up. I had ran out of space. So I had to delete some videos from my, off my phone. So the whole time I thought I was recording, but I wasn't. So some of that, some of those clips might have got messed up. But basically out of there, I got some stuff for lunch and I bought some socks. Don't judge me. Yes, I bought socks from the dollar store. All my socks aren't from the dollar store, so don't do not do that. But I just needed some socks. So I said, Mine, why, why not get them out of there? So then I got some stuff for lunch. I got everything in my backpack now. Which is why I'm glad I bought this because it leaves my hands free and I can just put everything on my back. Now I need to go to McDonald's, which is, I gotta go this way to get to McDonald's. But then I gotta go far below, which is the opposite way. Did buy me a Sprite. I love a Sprite. Sprite's one of my favorite sodas. My favorite soda of all time is root beer, though. Root beer is my favorite soda. So if you ever meet me, bring me a root beer. I don't drink alcohol, but I'll drink a root beer. And I'll walk past this fireworks tent, the tent, and show you guys. The firework tent is down here. I'm gonna walk closer so you guys can see it. You guys are probably have this in your city wherever you live because 4th of July is approaching. I just wanted to get some footage for you guys. Then I got people staring at me. Which I'm telling you, the, the thing that stops that is when people stare at you, you stare at them back. But look at all the fireworks. Guys, what should I get for McDonald's? Should I be healthy or should I just get whatever? Normally I get a um, McChicken and a sweet tea, but I already got something to drink. I might get a McChicken. I don't know what else I'm going to get to eat. I'm super hungry though. I haven't eaten nothing all day. I don't know what to get to eat. I made chicken and what else? I wish, I wish you guys could like actually leave comments for me. But just comment below. If you're watching this video, Pause the video right now and tell me what you get when you go to McDonald's. Tell me your order. I don't know what I'm going to get. 
Alright. Just came from McDonald's. You guys follow me on Snapchat. You saw what I had. Uh, just finished my lunch at... Uh, there's a staring at me. God damn. <laughs> uh, just finished my lunch at uh, McDonald's. The weather is really beautiful out here. That's why I really like like doing my errands on days like this. And this is why I enjoy walking. For number one, it's good for you. It's good exercise. Number two, you can really enjoy the weather. You can feel like the wind and the sun and everything. If you drive in the car, you really can't. You really can't experience that. You really can't enjoy it, the weather as much unless you're like really out in it. Now I hate days when it's super hot, but days like this when it's a little heated, but you got a wind, you got a breeze blowing. It's 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 not that bad. So that's why I really enjoy walking and just being around and being able to full uh, feel the effects of nature and everything like that. Um, I probably don't walk as much as I used to, but. I enjoy walking. Walking is one of my favorite things to do and also bike riding. <clears throat> a couple years ago, before I moved before I moved to Pennsylvania and I lived in Maryland, I would walk probably close to 40 miles a week. Which depending on who you are, maybe a lot may not may maybe a lot may not be a lot, but I used to walk like 40 40 miles a week. Then once I moved to Pennsylvania I stopped. But just a little history of my life. Now I'm, now I'm on my way to Five Below. I, hit, I feel the wind blowing past my hand. I have to Five Below, get some stuff there, and come straight back home. It's almost five o'clock, so by the time I get back home, it should be like six, six fifteen. Then I get home, relax, play some Xbox, and just enjoy the rest of the day. Hopefully, you guys are having a good day. Hopefully. <laughs> My forehead is sweaty. Um, I don't know why, but AT and T is behind me. You guys can see it. Um, but I, I got this one gospel song stuck in my. Well, it's not. It's not a, a gospel song. It's a, it's a praise that's stuck in my head. I don't know why. It's just been really just stuck in my head. And I wish I could play the organ. Wish I could play the drums. I know how to play the piano a little bit. But really wish I could play the organ or I could play the drums. That's something I would have learned during my lifetime. But it's stuck in my head. If I can include a clip, if I can send, if I can somehow download a clip and insert it into the vlog, I will. But it's just stuck in my head, and I can't get it out my head. <laughs> hey. New video ideas. I'm gonna try some new Taco Bell stuff. I haven't had Taco Bell in like two or three years. Um, last time, oh snap. They're looking at me while I'm vlogging. <laughs> These two girls came around the corner when I started vlogging. They looked at me like I was a crazy psychopath. Alright, but I want to try Taco Bell. I haven't had it in two or three years. Let me tell you, the day I had that Chipotle, oh goodness, that's an instant enema. Basically, like, take it to lax too. Then I had sweet frogs yesterday for the first time, which is basically frozen yogurt. Never had frozen yogurt before. And I'm like semi lactose intolerant, oh goodness. These challenges be messing me up. That's why I have to wait till. I do challenges when I don't have to work the next couple of days because I'm not trying to go in to work messed up like that, you know? That's why when I have videos planned, I have to make sure it aligns with my work schedule. So if I do a video, like, if I know I work on Saturday, I'll do the video on, on Wednesday. That way I have Thursday and Friday to, like, get it out of my system. Because it, it's no point being uncomfortable at work, you know? That's going to make the eight hours go by real slow. I'm super sweaty. I'm almost near Target. Almost near Five Below. Super sweaty.
Okay, I'm, I'm done my shopping at Five Below. Um, so happy to have the employee discount because if I was a regular customer, the stuff probably would have cost twenty-one, twenty-two dollars. But since I have an employee discount, it only came up to fourteen dollars, which isn't bad at all. Basically, what I got, I got some candy to do some reviews on. I got some new headphones because I needed some headphones. And I bought something for a project, which I'm going to keep secret, but stay tuned. I bought a DIY project, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that. But yeah, that's pretty much all I got, and I'm well under budget. So I still got a little bit of extra money to spend, which is really good, because I try to keep myself on a budget, not try not to spend too much money. But sometimes you got to treat yourself in life. I mean, you only live once, so sometimes you got to treat yourself to some goodies. But I've got everything that I needed. Now I'm on my way home. I'm not going to end the vlog just yet. Just in case something interesting happens. I got people staring at me like I'm crazy. But super hot out here. I probably know I look a hot mess. But it's what it is. Guys I'm so embarrassed. I'm so embarrassed. I was vlogging and I was super loud. And I didn't know these people were sitting right there on the benches behind me. And I was being super loud too. I'm kind of embarrassed because I don't normally vlog loud unless I'm known by myself. But they were sitting over there in the benches and I did not see them. So while I'm vlogging, I look over. Like after I had ended the clip, I looked over and I saw them and I said, oh my goodness. They probably think it's mad crazy talking to herself. Walking down the street. Before I get back to the house, I'm going to show you guys my new book bag. But I was so embarrassed because I was being really loud. Oh man, that was embarrassing. Normally I don't get embarrassed like that, but hey guys, I'm so happy I got my backpack. Cause you guys don't understand the struggle of how I used to have to try to hold um, the bags and the camera at the same time. I used to struggle doing that. So now that I got this backpack, it is super great. I'm gonna show you guys once I get home. I keep having. I was trying to say there's a lot of black girls out in their booty shorts today. I don't know why, cause it's summertime. I've never seen as many black girls out here, but it's a lot of black girls out today. I've never seen that many out here before, but I'm just saying. I didn't mean to sound racist when I said that, but where I live is like 80% white. So, I mean, you see black people here and there, but when you see a lot of black people, that's rare. Especially a lot of black girls in their booty shorts, that's rare. So. There are some black people here, but this is like 80% white. So when you see other black people, they're here and they're scattered. But when you see a lot of them, which I expect that to happen because it's summertime. So during the summertime, a lot of people are out. But it was just kind of rare to see so many out today. But it is a really good day. Well, the weather's hot today, so that makes sense. But I'm going to show you guys once I get to my book bag, once I get to the house. But thank you guys for watching. Make sure you subscribe, comment, like, and I will see you guys next time. Peace. You can take off your clothes As long as you coming home Girl, I don't mind The ballers in here tonight They gon' buy a 